this edition of That's My Business, we're talking to Dave Altoona, Director of Business Development for IamAStuffedAnimal.com. Welcome to the show, Dave. Thanks, Rich. Thanks for having me. Dave, what is a I Am A Stuffed Animal, and how did you come up with the idea? What it is is a, uh, a stuffed animal version of you, but it doesn't have to be you. It could be your mother, your boyfriend, your girlfriend, your refrigerator, your dog, whatever you want. And basically how it works is you send in a picture, or up to three pictures of whatever you want turned into a stuffed animal, and we do that for you. And how did you come up with the idea? We built on a terrible idea that my buddy had. He had an idea of, of making stuffed animals of, uh, of sports coaches. We said nobody would want to buy that, uh, but it would be really cool to make stuffed animals of each other, and, uh, and from there the idea was born. Now, I noticed that you sent out uh, lookalike buddies to some of the media, and they gave you some great press coverage. That was pretty clever. Yeah, well, the nice thing about our product is that it's, it's easy to talk about. Uh, it's kind of a little bit flattering, so, uh, so it works well in that, in that sense. And so that was from the beginning. That was immediately what our marketing strategy was, at least initially, was, you know, get it out to some people with a voice and, uh, and just take the initiative to make the buddy of them and hopefully they'll find it flattering enough to talk about it. How many buddy dolls have you made? Uh, we've actually made thousands of buddy dolls. We, uh, we launched on an uh, ESPN podcast, which gave us a nice bump to, to begin, and then right after we launched in October, uh, Christmas season picked up, and we just were you know, uh, inundated with orders for Christmas, and uh, it, it's, it's been a roller coaster ever since. Now, do you make them all yourself, or do you have help? We have a network of designers. Uh, who designed the buddies, uh, and then we have a full-time employee who kind of uh, consolidates the designs and gets them out uh, and onto fabric, and then, uh, and then we have them sewn by a separate team of individuals. Dave, what advice would you give to someone starting a business? Well, I think the main piece of advice that I would give is to be persistent. Um, what you want to do is you want to test your idea. Uh, you want to give it a good shot to succeed. So, uh, you know, we were very diligent in trying to find a, a good way to launch the idea we found the podcast, and it got a lot of visitors to our site. In that small sample, you know, we got purchases, and that's kind of your proof that, that the, the idea works. And then uh, once you're confident that it's a good idea and it's going to work, you just really got to uh, be persistent, get it out there, get it in front of as many people as you can, and just, uh, and just keep moving forward. Well, thanks, Dave, for talking with us today on That's My Business. Hey, no problem, Rich. Thanks for having me.